Ladies and gentlemen, today is a very big day because we have finally made it to Black Ops 2, which is my favorite zombies of all time. It's been almost a year since I've even touched this game. And what I wanted to do today is record my very first time playing it again. We're going to be playing Newtown Zombies, which is the hardest map, but hopefully things go well. Oh my God. <laughs> Black Ops 2 Zombies. You ready? <laughs> It doesn't even work. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in. Oh my God. Look at that, dude. This beautiful. So cool, man. Totally forgot. Like, oh, you want to play transit? Yeah, sure. Oh my God. Want to play Mob of the Dead? I sure want to play Mob of the Dead, but we're also not playing that. No, we're playing simple yet infuriatingly difficult. Nuketown Zombies. Oh my God, dude. It's like getting injected straight into my bloodstream. Stream. Look at this beautiful map. Oh my god, dude. Makes me so happy, man. This is just, it's such an upgrade from Black Ops 2. It looks better. It feels better. It feels smooth, man. It feels so smooth. Oh, hi. Oh, I miss you guys. Hey. Man, the voice acting is a little weird. Won't lie. <laughs> Look at that. What? How is this already here? Doesn't it? <laughs> okay. Whatever. I wonder if it is possible for us to complete the Pack-a-Punch challenge with our very first time returning to this game mode. That sounds pretty hard, I won't lie. Zombies are more aggressive in Black Ops 2 as well. Actually, Black Ops 2 has the hardest, like, early rounds because... Ooh! Because there's no three hits, but they're almost aggressive as BO3 zombies. Honestly, I have no idea if that's true, but dude, this game is so smooth! Oh my god, the drops, man. Oh, dude, the Easter egg. Oh, man, if we get to round 25, we will get what we just did in Moon. That's pretty cool. So yeah, Nuketown Zombies takes place at the exact same time as the events on Moon. And when you die, the rocket that comes down is the ones that you just sent from Moon. It doesn't get a whole lot cooler than that. It's like we haven't left. Oh my God, Box is here, bro. The YY? I know you guys don't miss that. You know, it just occurred to me that uh, the drops are random on this map, aren't they? Oh, right. So we could go like 20 rounds, no jug. I don't know if I'm ready for that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I feel like I'm overall better on a controller, but like I've still been away from zombies for two years, you know? I need to get a little more experience under my belt. Okay, first drop. I mean, uh, apart from Quick Revive, which didn't actually drop, but okay, it's coming down over here. Ladies and gentlemen, we have... Dude. It's like they know this is our first game back and they're just trying to be extra nice. That is what you love to see, man. Oh my goodness. This is like the perfect, the perfect setup to come back. Really, I mean, literally we just got Jug first go, but th that's that's all you need, dude. That's what I love about this map. It hates, I mean, don't get me wrong. It's just such a good map to learn how to train on. Like this is where I learned how to train on. Not the Kino stage, you know? Nuketown friggin' zombies, man. Dude, it makes me so happy that we took the time to go through all of World of War and Black Ops 1. Because, like, I just have such an appreciation for this. Like, I know it's so simple, but it's so... It's just it's just all you need, man. It's just all you need. All right, let's buy this door just for a little extra safety. Okay, so literally... Oh, my God. That's a... Man. <laughs> that's a sound I haven't heard in a while. The chance... Dude, I... Freaking love Black Ops 2, man. I like Black Ops 1. I love Black Ops 2. Dude, the spawns on this map are insane. Oh my god, we already got another drop. I wonder if they changed it. Man, there's no way they went and updated a seven-year-old game. Okay, next drop. Right in our backyard. Oh my god, dude. What is this luck? Like, <laughs> I just know, like... In the past, Pack a Punch Challenge, this was the perfect, this was the, exactly what you wanted. You want to jug there because it's easy to pick up. Pack a Punch because, you know, you just go there at the end of the rounds. Both on this side because this is where you train. Now, I just need to be honest, guys. I don't know if I'm going to be able to beat this challenge. It's been a long time. But we're going to try anyway. Why not, right? Oh, man, that pack camo. You know, not as good as Doris, but uh, better than, than Black Ops 1, I would say. Anyway, we're going to go for this challenge. Just do our best. That's all I can say. But I just wanted to record my first time coming back to this game. And, uh, you know, go for gold, right? But that's the great thing with this challenge. There's no guarantee I'll get it, you know? But I care so much 
about this run. Oh man, you know, it's really not a horrible area to train. I don't want to get too ahead of myself, but I guess it's just those little moments of horrible luck where you get like the worst spawns. Those are what separate the, uh, I guess the people who know how to play this map and the people who don't. Like, you know, that, okay. Yeah, I'm not, I uh, see. I'm not so used to these like crazy dips and turns. Oh, the timer's just going down. Oh, it's so cool. Also, it's neat because the zombie's eyes are yellow, but on round 25, they switched over to blue with Richtofen. Okay, let's go get some more ammo. Dude, Mustang and Sally's feel weird. <laughs> like, I will admit, that's, that's a Black Ops 1 thing, you know? But like, these ones? I mean, they feel good, but they're just... They're different. They sound different, too. I guess they look different. They're just very different, yeah. Yeah, every Black Ops 2 map has its own pack cam, all right? Or is it the Transit crew has their own, and then Mob and Origins has their own? Like, both individual. I don't remember. Dude. I love this map because it's such a pure, like, it's just a condensed pure zombies experience. If we are going to do this challenge, we are going to need to trade out our good guns, which is sad, but let's just do this real quick. You're dead. Oh my god. And a, a little hello to the Galil. You're such a beautiful weapon. Almost like a farewell to Black Ops 1 in a way. Except, dude, that's another thing they did so good, is they brought back all the amazing guns from Black Ops 1. You got the Galil. You got... The Colt. You got... That might be it. Oh, I guess you got the AK-74. You. There's a few other sort of weird ones. It's weird because I complain about, like, all the Black Ops 1 SMGs. I mean, this thing doesn't have a lot of ammo, but it it just... I think it's that it's just stronger, maybe. Oh! Oh, first red! Oh, first red! Oh! Okay, welcome to Nuketown Soppies. Ah! Oh my god, man. Yeah, there, that was... That was one of those moments. I mean, I hate that I had to pack a bunch of the Galil so early, but here it is, guys. Well, I mean, at least it's, at least it's got some power. You know we're gonna optimize this. See, I'm gonna try to optimize it, but I'm also not gonna be stupid. All right, well, that wasn't the best double points, but I'd rather be safe. Oh my God. I'm thinking maybe we pack a punch this uh, MP5 and then keep it as our training weapon. It's really lightweight, good for training getting a little bit weaker too. I think part of the reason I love this map so much is that it's perfect to my skill level. Like, if you're insane at zombies, it's probably too easy, but I uh, I just, I find it perfect. Now, ladies and gentlemen, let's get this MP5 done. It's so perfect for the pack punch challenge too. When you get the right stuff, that is. Oh my God, I forgot Double Tap 2 is on this map. Oh man, right. I got him. Uh, nothing says pack punch challenge like knifing on round 12. Ah, uh, that's what I deserve. All right, let's hit the box, get something else packed. Ooh, something's happening. Hello, Samantha. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, actually, I'm not gonna pack a punch right now because I don't wanna lose it in the pack punch machine. So what are we, three guns? Okay. As I recall, this map is a slow start. That nuke was actually super unfortunate. We lost a lot of points on that. I will say one difference I feel coming back to this is, is that playing on keyboard and mouse makes me more confident in my ability to aim well. And I'm not so afraid to shoot my way through sometimes. Whereas I think in the past, I had to rely a little bit more on training. So I think the drops come at random intervals, but like, you know, round six to eight or six to nine and like we just happened to get lucky where we got the six drop but this is something new gonna be the other side oh did i miss it i must have missed it okay so ah oh, double tap two now as i recall we probably don't actually want that yet because for gun is a little weaker we can get more points i think that's the crazy deep strategy okay i'm sorry this is another good gun i don't really want to have to pack a punch but it is what it is, I guess. Yeah, like we got two of the best guns on the map already packed. And three if you consider the Colt. That's okay though. Maybe next gun we'll do is just like a bad wall weapon or something. Like we could do the Olympia and the... I was gonna say Stako, but the Remington. Oh my God, that's a name I haven't said in a while. See, like there's just, I don't know, just kind of observing myself, but I feel like in the past I would have tried to train out of that. It doesn't seem all that smart. 
Okay. Oh, that's not. Oh, no. Oh, man. We got stuck. Wow. Wow. That was scary. I thought we had the full horde. Oh, my God. I really thought that was going to be a down anyway. Yeah, Emtar is an uh, absolute beast, man. Oh, my goodness. This requires a lot of focus. But, yeah, this is definitely the better side to train on. Okay. I uh, don't really care about the insta-kill. Oh, I didn't mean to hit the box either. Oh, well, that's amazing. So, okay. Why don't we go ahead and... Let's just do the Olympia. Probably the worst wall weapon. Sorry, Olympia gang, but you know it's true. <laughs> okay. Woo! So that's five. Fifteen rounds. Now, just out of curiosity... This thing's actually pretty good, man. Yeah, this is not the Black Ops 1 Olympia, that's for sure. Wow, okay. Wonder what this does to a horde. Okay, so kind of just like kills a single zombie, but you know, guy in my way. Got him on the first shot. Not bad, man, not bad. Oh, round 15, we're getting the walkers. I forgot about those guys. All right, well, that was a lot of fun. Let's continue on, though. Okay, an old friend. I love this. Oh, this is such a good challenge to come back to, even if we don't do it. Like, oh, ultra and violet. Yes, five sevens. All right, six down. Okay, my dual wield pistols. Oh, man. Okay, they're, they're all right, I guess. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, not bad, not bad. It's crazy, because I'm out here being so used to no double tap. Our gun's certainly gonna go a longer way. Ooh, big double points, guys. Don't get the nuke, Pat. All you have to do is train around the nuke. Double points! Yes. Ooh, oh, that's down. That is most certainly a down, yeah. <laughs> All right, it happens. Ooh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, monkey, monkey, monkey. Oh my god. Woo! Dude, thank god for monkeys. Man, we keep botching these double points. <laughs> I keep dying for the drops, man. Well, actually, first down, I guess, but still, it's... It happens. You know, thank god we have monkeys, because I don't know if I would have got out of that otherwise. Okay. It's an interesting weapon, and I don't think it's all that great. The M8A1. Wasn't this thing crazy in multiplayer, though? I forget. Has the mode button, but you can't toggle it in zombies. Love that. Wait. Oh yeah, it is burst. Okay, not great. Maybe I just have trash aim though. I feel like it might be good at, against a horde. Also, kind of want to get rid of this MP5. I don't feel safe with it anymore. Woo! Oh yeah, man. Oh yeah, this is... Oh no. Oh my god, dude. Oh, this is spicing up, man. Holy balls. I'm bad. No, don't say that, Pat. You're not bad. This is my first time playing Black Ops 2 Zombies in a year. Ha! Okay, we're, we're on some shaky ground here, guys. Wow. All right, guys. This game is it's a tough map, man. Whew, things have got us down. But I think we got this. Well, maybe. We'll see. <laughs> Last quick revive. All right. I love it, man. I love the challenge. Here we go. Ooh, wow. This is a gun I forgot about. And it is a great weapon. Okay, let's go hammer. Oh, that's so good. I think that's got us to seven. Oh, uh, man, do I really want to pack this? Such a good point gun. Let's hit it once more. I'm going to regret this so hard, but... Okay, that is... This is a perfect training weapon. All right, the sledgehammer. Dude, so good. Oh, we got an announcement. Okay, guys, it is time for me to focus. Yeah, better mobility than even the Colt, I think. You know, that's just a sound that brings back a whole lot of nostalgia. Wow. Ooh, this thing's not very good, eh? Woo! And ladies and gentlemen, that is the final drop. Going over to the backyard. So the, I gotta remember, that's where I've got caught few times now. Kind of a good, like, training kill those guys. All right. And ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be round. Next gun is... That's not a weapon. Are we at nine weapons? Oh, hey, what's up, box? Okay. Oh, we already had that. 
Oh my god. Wow. Horrible box luck. I just remember there are no barriers on this map. Let's hit this again. Oh, you guys saw that, didn't you? Man, that's a good weapon. That's a good weapon. I want that. <laughs> this thing's a beast too, though. Cannot wait to pack a punch this old friend. Man, I forgot this was in the game. I feel like the cheek has got to be a pretty good point gun. Oh, wow. That's scary. All right, let's go for this pack. We going for it? Yep. Oh, no, we're not. <laughs> Abort. Okay. I, I don't know, man. Maybe we should just wait. Oh, the fire sale. I think this is usually how I die, but free guns are free guns. So, oh, that's something we need. Actually, why don't we hit it again? Oh, yeah. See, that's where I die every time, man. Hit both of them because we're crazy. War machine and RPD. Okay, well, I mean, we got to pack. We got to pack everything, so it doesn't really matter. Wow, the cap 40, man. Oh my god, dude. Okay, executioner. Yes. Ho oh, ho. Okay, and the old cap 40. All right, guys, so that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm happy with that. Okay, so this thing's not very good, but the voice of justice is pretty spicy. Definitely needs double tap though, which I think we might have to buy soon. I don't know if I'm gonna ever get speed cola. It's a lot of money for something that we shouldn't have to rely on. So we'll see. Anyway, I am very excited about this. Oh, oh, oh man, that's some spicy meatballs. Okay, it's not insane, but it's pretty good. See, this is why I love Black Ops 2. I really think it had the best overall weapon variety of any game because it's got some unique weapons like the Executioner. Um, I mean, you've got good weapons, but it's not like Black Ops 2 where everything is good, where the box is just not even necessary because double pack-a-punch because of every amazing wall weapon, you know? It's, um, I just think it struck a really good balance on weapons. Okay, so yeah, definitely don't want to rely on this thing, but I mean, if there's a single zombie in my way, five shots shouldn't really be a problem. Ooh, man, two hits is too many on this map. One, sure, fine, gonna happen. Two, no way. It's a shame there's no mule kick on this map, really. Or stamina up, that would be crazy. Honestly, just all the Black Ops 1 maps would fit perfectly on Nuketown. All right, guys, let's continue on. Well, we were gonna have to do this sooner or later, so... There it is. A whole ballistic knife. You know, the ballistic knife, despite being trash, is also kind of interesting, at least. I mean, I know it's a Black Ops 1 weapon, but I'm glad it came back. Dang. I think I should go for double tap, guys. Because if I don't go for it, I'm going to regret that choice. So, hello, other side of Nuketown that I have not visited yet. Oh, I almost fell down. Yeah, Speed Cola, that's fine for now, I guess. Nice. Double tap two. Hello. I mean, we could get like the M14 still. B23R. Yeah, let's get the M14 out of the way. So now this fires two bullets instead of one. That's crazy. All right, so we got a little bit more beef now in our executioner. And uh, this is kind of whatever. It's 12 guns packed. Wow. If we can run 10,000 points around, I think this will go pretty well. For, like from here on out. Oh, man. Yes. Love this. But, uh, oh, oh, boy. I sure do feel safe with this. Not too safe, but it's no thunder gun, but uh, it's good. M14. Not so good. Not so good. But it's actually decent for points. Something I never used to do is like actively control the horde. It's like when you're in the middle of a round, you shouldn't just, you shouldn't kill the entire horde because then you basically recreate the start of a round, which is like the scariest part of a round because there's so many zombies spawning in at once. Yeah, never knew that. Okay. Pack that, hit that, grab that, grab that, run over here, hit this. Love it. She calm. No, thank you. That was a pretty good process. All right, 13 weapons. We are over a third of the way there. Wow, this is a tough challenge. Oh, this is a fun weapon. 
not the best for points. I'm trying to think what the smart thing to do here is. What I want to do is pack this and keep it, but I need a point gun for next round. So I think we're going to have to do something a little risky. We're going to buy the B23R, kind of whatever point gun. Will be good for points, though. Train with this and just be ready to throw monkeys. I mean, it's not horrible. Like, if there's one zombie in our way, we should be fine. We just have to play super smart. I still would argue that my biggest weakness as a zombies player to this day is myself. It's like, I feel like when I sit down and focus, I can do a pretty good job, but I just suck at focusing. Okay, there's five grand. All right. Nice. Just, yeah. This thing's pretty good. Oh yeah, she's a real beast. Actually, this might be, is there a better shotgun in Black Ops 2? I mean, I may be the executioner. Been like knifing on round 22. Man, this is such a classic weapon. I forgot that this is the one you get on transit. All right, and ladies and gentlemen, there it is. 15 weapons. Okay. Can we please not die in this double points? Double points! Oh, the points. Oh my god! Oh, I almost just died for the SMR. Oh, I forgot this exists. See, this is another weapon I'm talking about, man. Like, I like that it sucks, you know? Oh man, look at this bad boy. Look at this beastie boy. Yeah. Mmm. The staple gun, dude. Oh my god. Doesn't even shoot straight. Doesn't even shoot straight. <laughs> so good, man. Like it's just funny. What's that? The SMR, ladies and gentlemen. The Smiler. <laughs> dude, I love it. Absolutely love it. I mean, you don't think we're actually gonna keep this thing, do you? Oh, we already have that. We gotta get at least one kill with the Smiler. Wow. Wow. A rifle, man. Shouldn't take that long to kill. <laughs> like, the M14 might be better. Ooh. I will take this. It's crazy that we still haven't seen a ray gun. I'm not surprised we haven't seen the Mark II yet, but like. Oh, the old target finder. Classic. All right, 17 weapons. I don't know why, but I just have a huge fear I'm gonna go down this round. So I'm just gonna say it, make it real, and work to avoid it. Uh, this guy's no longer a, a one-shot mister. I mean, two, that's fine. Oh yeah, the damage. It is a wee bit slow. Hey, bad. All right, I think that's round. Oh, that was a real treat. I love the LSAT. But all good things must come to an end. Well, something else we gotta do, so let's do it. The Type 25. Kinda forgot about this gun. Ooh, not bad. Yeah, it'll make for a good point gun. Oh! Dude, you gotta res look, blue eyes, blue eyes. Man, you gotta respect Nuketown for that. Like, yeah, okay, sure. Not the most complicated map, not the most detailed, but they didn't have to do that, you know? And they're, it's just a really nice thought. Such a cool little piece of lore. Oh man, it's just like, it's so insignificant, but blue eyes. Wow, oh my God, dude, this gun is like too strong. I don't want to do that. Oh, wow, that was risky. <laughs> okay, ladies and gentlemen, that is round. Next gun. Hey, there it is. All right, nice. So the thing that I recall is you cannot get the Ray Gun Mark II when you have the Ray Gun. So I love it. 
but I gotta trade it. Okay. We're also gonna have to open up this for the AK-74U. I think that's it though, right? Yeah. Next gun is the beautiful, oh my God. Now this is something you love to see. Oh. So good. That's 20 guns. I just realized I might not even want this because it's not very good for points. But I want to hold on to it for a little bit because I freaking love this weapon. I mean, actually, we could iron sight it, but I feel like the shotgun's a little safer. Oh! Like, it's pretty easy to miss. Hit an arm. But it's also pretty easy to hit and get a headshot. Or, you know, whatever. All right, one more because I love it. But this guy. It's like for the first time, they made a sniper viable in zombies. Don't know why it took them so long. Actually, you know what? I might take these. I know they suck, but they'll make a good point weapon. All right, that is round. Please give me Mark II. Nope. All right, well, that's something we need. Ah, well, if it isn't my old nemesis. I hate myself so much. Ah, oh, this is gonna be a sucky round. Bro, can we just take a moment? Dude, the noise, just the noise. Ah, <laughs> oh, this thing was too good, man. A troll weapon ahead of its time, man. All right, you know we're going for it. There it is. Now, what does this thing turn into? What's it called? Like, I think it's got a pretty funny name, right? Oh, the dystopic demolisher. Seems a little far-fetched. Well, that's not bad. Granted, we can't really use it because it's a huge waste of points, but... It's not bad. Not bad at all, actually. Okay, we're gonna do something really risky. And that is purchase this guy. Actually, that wasn't too bad. Oh, yeah. Double points. What a blessing. Ooh, yes. Okay, I didn't want to grab that nuke. Oh, my God. Yeah, we'll take that. Hey, that's something we need. Oh, this thing's not that good, is it? That's okay. All right. That is our last pistol. <laughs> Cries in Ray Gun Mark II. Boop. You know what? Let's do... Then... No, 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 no. Let's do the M16. So we have nine guns left to pack. I think we're at 23. All right, let's see what you got, M16. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, not the best point gun. You know what I want to do? I want to pack a punch. Oh my God, I'm going to die. Haha, <laughs> JK. Come on. Oh, let's get it. Was that the Barrett? Yeah, we need that. And five sevens. All right, that works. This is not horrible. Woo! This thing's not bad. Man, this version of the Barrett's really got some Modern Warfare 2 energy. Okay, I'm gonna hit the box once. Oh, why you gotta do that? Yes. And let's just go with the AK-74U. Okay, so all we need is the Remington. So all we need from the box is the Fal M27 S12 RPG and Mark II. Shotgun ammo levels are getting dangerously low. But if they gave me a Mark II, everything would be fine. Oh my God. Thank you so much, game. Yes, ammo. It's much needed. Dude, the AK-74U though. Amazing point gun. It's literally like perfect right now. Oh, big double points. This is literally the most perfect double points of all time. Perfect location, perfect cord, perfect gun. Double points. Oh my.
my god. And to top it all off, dude, perfect timing. I don't even know if I'm ready to pack this thing. It might just, it might, we might just want to keep it as a point gun. Box, box, box. Uh, you know what we should just do and really get out of the way, though, is the Remington. It's uh not very good, I don't think. All right, there we go. All right, one kill. You know what? It's that bad. No, doesn't even deserve a kill. Wow, first time we've been over here. Oh. Wow. Oh, my God. Ah! Come on. Oh, my God. Oh! 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 That's so rude! Oh, yeah. I remember why I hate this challenge now. <gasps> I take everything I said back. I love this map, and I freaking love this weapon. Oh, my God, dude. Two shots. Two shots on 29. It's not even pack and punched. Wait, what? Thought this thing was strong. Anyway, guys, the M27 is the best assault rifle in Black Ops 2 Zombies. And the worst thing is it's only on this map. Okay, I don't think it was it's as strong as the two-shot kill, but... Oh yeah. Okay, that it's reasonable. I mean, it, it is round 30. What a weapon, man. Okay, quick double points. Wow. That's almost 20 grand in a round, you guys. Oh, there it is. The M27 has been packed. So we've done one full box loop. Oh, you gotta stop doing that game. Look how good that is. Really sad, but I am gonna have to get rid of it. Big F's in the chats, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, all we need is the Foul RPG and Mark II. Oh, and the S12. All right, one more hit. 12 grand. Please, please, Mark II. Oh my God. You know what? Come on. Oh, you hate to see it, guys. Dude, in 25 hits of the box, we've gotten one weapon we need. There's still three more out there. Whoa. Oh my God, that's our closest call in a while. Okay, game's just making sure I'm not falling asleep. Oh my God, what was that? Oh, wow. Okay. You know, I thought this was a challenge of skill, but it's a challenge of determination more than anything. How many rounds can you play hitting the box, getting nothing, and just hope that the numbers are going to be on your side? This is a challenge for Mad Men. At least we have a Galil. It's actually a prime opportunity for a fire sale. Come on. Nope. Yes, let's go. We need that. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. That was so huge. We got it for free. And this foul is just sounds beefy. Okay, guys. There it is. The win. Hey, it's unicorn. Okay. All we have left is the AK-74U, the S12, the RPG, and the Mark II. Oh, my God. I can't believe we still have four guns, but we do have 14 hits. Oh, <gasps> I never thought I'd be so happy to see an RPG. I, I don't even want to use this thing. All right. So that is 27. No, that's 29. We only have three guns left. All right. Once for old time's sake. Oh, right, it's like automatic. Oh my God. Oh, I want you so bad, but I need to be. Well, actually I need some points. All right, let, let, let's do it once. Oh, I'm gonna die. Well, that was fun. Forgot how good the RPG is. I rightfully should. Oh my God, crawlers, crawlers, crawlers. Knife big on round 32. Woo! Just time for a fire save. Oh, heavy breathing. Come on. Ooh. All right, well, at least we got a free point gun. And a fine point weapon it is. Oh, 
Oh, little loo. That little clutch is what I mean. Okay, twenty thousand points. One man. Okay, if the next two hits go perfectly, we can finish this challenge. Oh, what a shocker! <laughs> One man. One aneurysm. One mystery box. This is the stupidest challenge I've ever done. <laughs> oh my god. Well, one AK-74 for you. I mean, we're gonna have to get it packed at some point. You know what? I'm just gonna take a little hit on the box. I fe I'm feeling lucky. Come on, one more. Oh my god. 33 rounds, no Mark II. I'm honestly starting to wonder if it's even going to spawn for me. Oh my god. What if I don't have buried installed? No, I did, I did. I think. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is 30. Oh, that's a slot. And a double points. Big double points. Oh, big double points. That's what you love to see. Ooh. Oh, we're out of ammo. Ooh. Wow, okay, things just got a whole lot harder. Well, time to start hitting the box. Hey! <gasps> is that? <gasps> there it is! Oh my god, guys! Second last weapon! Come on, Mark II. Mark II right here and now. Let's send it out. Okay, this thing is probably gonna be trash by 33, so let's just go straight for the pack. Ladies and gentlemen, according to my calculations, we are on our final gun. Woo! Okay, not as good as the M1216, but it's fine. 14 hits, please. For the love of all things that are right in this world, give me the Mark II. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. I want to die. <laughs> it's one o'clock, what? Dude, I've been recording for so long. Oh my God. Please, just be nice. Oh my god, the S12 again. <sighs> I have to check. Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Zombies. Says they're all there. All right, this is my ultimatum. I'm gonna do one more round. If we don't give it, I accept that Nuketown wins. That's it, one more round. This is it, guys. All right, 38,000 points. If this doesn't do it, it's not in the box. We've hit it already over 100 times. Like, <laughs> okay, great start. <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my God. I didn't think it was in there. I really didn't. Ladies and gentlemen, first game back, Black Ops 2 Zombies, the Pack-A-Punch Challenge on Nuketown, somehow complete. I don't know how that happened. But we freaking did it, ladies and gentlemen. All right, now listen, you're still here, you're watching. I need you to subscribe to the channel right now because we are really close to 3 million subscribers and I, and I don't even understand how we managed to do this. This is a challenge that took me a summer. First try. Also, if you're watching this, you better smash that freaking like button. And most importantly of all, honestly, just thank you guys for watching the whole way through. And second, most importantly of all, thank you to Roman, who had to edit this. Ladies and gentlemen, the beautiful, the one and only, the Raygun Mark II. It's just that good. That is it. We did it. 30. Five freaking rounds. I never want to do it again, but guys, thank you so much. There it is, the ending to Moon, the ending to Duketown Zombies. That's it, peace out, you freaking nerds. Damn, Roman, this is gonna be a long recording. Shouldn't be too long of a video though. I'm trying not to talk too much.